Chicago, Chicago, my favorite place to snipe in. Shit. Pekorski was on his own. I figured he'd understand. I gotta get a closer look at Brummel's tattoo. hoping that becoming a super assassin meant I'd never have to see them again. It's on my balls, Wesley. And I'm tired of it. Well, I aim to please. Then your bloody aim is shit. I came for the loom. Not for you, asswipe. But now, I'm gonna kill you. Just for fun and a laugh. <laughs> How about
about your whole this. Come here, you fucking dickhead! Closer, he's not moving anywhere. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to kill this pussy bitch from back here. Enjoy watching me die, fuck. Just staying for the theater of it all. Actually, um, I need something from your corpse. <coughs> <coughs> yeah? Why the fuck didn't you say so? Take it. Remember, this was your call. And I gotta give you credit, man. I would have screamed like a bitch if that had been me. <laughs> the time. Where's it at? I'm guessing about three. Fuck me.
Shit balls! Didn't your mom tell you not to play with knives? This is coming from a dude who flunked Jim. The second piece of the puzzle. Literally. How'd they know? How did they know? Sorry? How the fuck did they know you were in Chicago? It was the kill order for my father's safe house. That's what you're after, isn't it? It's an important piece of fraternity business, and it should be protected. Your father never had the chance to tell you how this all began. Well, it started here. Your father thought he was answering a distress call from Sloan. 